how the correlation coefficient r is going to measure the strength and direction of a linear relationship between two quantitative variables. So when you see strength on a scatter plot, the tighter the pattern, the stronger the relationship is. And so a correlation coefficient that's closer to an absolute value of one indicates more strength. The sign, remember, just indicates the direction of the relationship. So because here, as age increases, distance is decreasing, it indicates that they have a negative association. So with that, you'll notice that there's a correlation coefficient sign here of negative 0.8. So that means that the type of association is negative. So we would describe this as negative. But the other thing that the correlation coefficient gives us is the strength of the relationship. So correlation coefficient gives us both strength and direction. So here it's negative, but the strength of it, because it's so close to an absolute value of one, we would also describe this as strong. So it would be a strong negative linear association. Now that should hopefully feel intuitive because the pattern is fairly tight. Now if you are comparing to another correlation coefficient, here we have study, so that would be our explanatory variable because it's on the x-axis, and we have sleep, which is our response variable because it's on the y-axis. This linear association is also negative, and we would notice that because if you look at as x increases, y is tending to decrease, so that's a negative linear association meaning that the two variables have a negative pattern or a negative association with one another. However, this one, you can see that the patterns are much looser, and so I would call this weak. Now, not only do I see that the pattern is looser as compared to what we see over here with age and distance to read a highway sign, I also see that my correlation coefficient is not as close to the absolute value of one, which indicates that it has a weaker relationship. So we're noticing that both in the pattern being much looser and the correlation coefficient as compared to what we see over here for age and distance to read a highway sign, not only are we seeing it in the scatter plot, but we're also seeing it in that correlation coefficient r. So when you compare or look at different scatter plots, the looser the pattern is, the weaker the relationship, and the tighter the pattern, the tighter, stronger the relationship is.